MCQ with one or more than one correct answers. A hydrogen like atom is in ground state absorbs n photons having same energy and emits exactly n photons when electronic transition takes place. Then what is the question? The energy of the absorbed photon may be. So it is hydrogen like species and electron is in the ground state absorbing n photons. Since whatever the number of photons are absorbed, same number of photons being emitted which is possible only when the electron get excited from n1 is equal to one state to n2 is equal to second state. So that this is n is equal to one, this is n is equal to two. So that whatever the energy that is absorbed, same energy will be given out when the electron transition takes place. If it is excited to higher levels, then the number of photons possible will be more than the number of photons absorbed. Thereby, n1 is equal to 1, n2 is equal to 2. But it is not hydrogen atom, hydrogen like spaces. So the energy difference between second and first orbit in hydrogen like spaces is given by delta E is equal to 10.2 into z square electron holes. Where z can vary for hydrogen atom 1, for helium ion 2, for lithium ion 3, for beryllium ion 4 and so on. So Z like as it is hydrogen like atom Z can be 2 so that delta E becomes 10.2 into 2 square that is 4. 4 into 10.2 is 40.8 electron volts. So thus if it is the hydrogen like species by taking an example of helium ion the energy of the photon corresponds to 40.8 electron volts. So therefore we have the option A. But if we take z is equal to 3 then delta e comes out to be 10.2 into 3 square that is 9 9 into 10.2 we have 91.8 electron volts so therefore this is also possible energy of the photons where we have d option as 91.8 electron volts so thereby d also becomes the option and when we take z is equal to 4 then delta e becomes how much 10.2 into z square that is 4 square 16 16 to 10 160 plus 3.2 so 163.2 electron volts will become the energy of the photon thereby why not c is also the option so the only wrong option among the a b c d is b so thus the answer for the question a c d